Well, we're coming off a pretty cool end to the weekend. Yesterday, temperatures were in the high 70s. We saw those late day thunderstorms roll through. The moisture is rolling out of the state and it's going to be a really beautiful start to this week. Mostly clear skies as the sun comes up near Lamar, crystal clear over Rocky Mountain National Park. It is a cool start to the morning, but it is dry and we'll see mostly clear skies through the rest of the afternoon. Low 50s currently downtown and out to the airport where winds relatively calm sustained from the west at eight miles per hour. So not much going on across our satellite and radar picture. As you can see, we do have a few lingering showers over the far southwest eastern corner of the state, but those will end here shortly. So out the door right now, we're only at 36 degrees over Estes Park, high 30s in Fraser and low 50s Greeley into Castle Rock down through Aurora. So we want that extra layer early on, but it's already 74 degrees in Grand Junction and big heat is set to build in all across the region over the next several days. But today will be the coolest afternoon on our seven day forecast. Looking ahead at metro area planner by 11 o'clock getting to 71 degrees ample sunshine you'll definitely want to layer on that sunscreen for today daytime highs set to top out in the low 80s a few degrees below average typically in early july denver sees highs in the upper 80s today will also be in the low 80s boulder and erie and 60s to low 70s mainly out west over our front range mountains and foothills looking at our high country planner not a lot of storm activity expected for today slight chance for a few gusty storms here and there but no risk of any severe weather and highs later on will top out in the upper 70s west of the divide from Steamboat to Aspen down through Gunnison and low 80s Pueblo to Lamar where we do have the possibility still of seeing a gusty storm or two. Not a lot of moisture expected with cells that form and no risk of any severe thunderstorms. So by mid morning still a lot of sunshine. There's that chance for a few storms down south near Springfield but it's not going to amount to much and then over the I-70 corridor north of Denver it's going to be dry clear and not too breezy this afternoon. So really nice conditions expected through this Monday. Temperatures will fall to the upper 50s early Tuesday and daytime highs are set to climb back to around 90 degrees. You can see a lot of sunshine to kick off the day tomorrow. We do have the possibility for a few of those showers and storms forming, but as we get into the rest of the week, not a lot of moisture all across the state and it's really going to be the heat we'll be talking about. This evening across the Denver area, temperatures falling to the upper 70s by 8 o'clock, starting off in the high 50s and right back to around 90 degrees downtown to Fort Collins and upper 80s, low 90s across the Eastern Plains. A lot of the country dealing with some sizzling heat and you can see that on our super seven day forecast tomorrow low 90s. Similar story on Wednesday. Not talking storm activity through the end of the week. Just hot and dry upper 90s near 100. We're going to be talking some near record temperatures through the weekend.